Good morning, Ole Valley High School. I'm Jenna. And I'm Danielle. Today is Friday, February 21st, 2020, and a cycle day one. Today is also National Caregivers Day, National Grain Free Day, and National Sticky Buns Day. Please rise for the pledge to the flag. Today's main lunch choice is bread and mozzarella sticks. The word of the day is stipulate. To make an agreement or conven convenient to do or forbear something, stipulate. Tonight is the second show of the third annual Mosaic concert. A limited number of tickets are available on showtix4u.com. That's spelled S-H-O-W-T-I-X, the number 4, U.com. And the remaining tickets will be sold at the door. Please remember that the doors will close at 7 o'clock p.m. so that the concert can begin. Are you 15 years of age or older? Are you looking for a summer job? The Ole Valley School District is hiring students to assist the custodial staff over the summer and applications are available now. Stop in the attendance office to pick up an application or find it on the school district's website. Applications are due by 3 o'clock p.m. on Monday, March 6, 2020, along with a letter of interest to Dr. Shank. Registration for Minithon is officially open. The registration form is available online only. Registration costs $20. Students will be available during both lunch periods next week to help you register. Both students and staff are allowed to register. Do you have a passion for design? Do you enjoy making art? If you answered yes to those questions, or even if you answered no, you might be just the person that our school's mini-thon is looking for. Currently, our school's mini-thon is looking for logo designs to fit our theme for this year's mini-thon. The selected theme is decades or through the years, and your logo should incorporate the slogan of let's leave cancer in the past. If you have any questions, please contact Andrew Klein. Attention any student interested in participating in a spring sport. Paperwork is due to the athletic office by the end of the day today. Attention Mosaic concert students. You are to report back to the school for tonight's concert by 6 o'clock p.m. at the latest. Attention 10th and 11th grade students. The Greater Reading Chamber Alliance is hosting their annual Young Leadership Conference at Penn State Berks on Friday, March 13th. This conference provides students the opportunity for leadership development, mentoring experiences, and career exploration. Any 10th and 11th grade students interested in attending should get a permission slip from the Guidance Office and return it by Tuesday, March 3rd. There are a limited number of spots for this trip. Next week is National FFA Week, and our school's FFA chapter has organized lots of activities throughout the week. Be sure to support FFA throughout the week by dressing up to support National FFA Week and by participating in all of the activities. Starting Monday, the FFA will be holding a food drive for the Ole Valley Food Pantry. The homeroom that brings in the most canned items will receive a Dunkin' Donuts breakfast. Monday's Spirit Week theme is Moo Cow Monday. Tuesday's Spirit Week theme is Tie-Dye Tuesday. Wednesday's Spirit Week theme is Camo. Thursday's Spirit Week theme is Blue and Gold or FFA Apparel. And Friday's Spirit Week theme is Flannel Friday. Also, as usual, the FFA will be hanging emblems on the wall with each student and staff member's name. So be sure to find yours and hand it in to an FFA member on the stage at lunch to trade it in for beef stick or veggie straws. The wrestling team will have indiv individuals competing at the District 3 individual tournament today and tomorrow. Today's Snapple Cap fact is number 182 in the series and states that a rainbow can only be seen in the morning or late afternoon. This concludes this morning's announcements for the Lynx Broadcast Network. I'm Jenna. And I'm Danielle. Have a great day.